welcome back, Nick and Lex here. Thank you so much for joining me to another episode of Metal with Nick. I'm so glad you guys are here. So today we're going to do a request for R. Gray. Thank you so much for your request. And I just saw something in the comment section where you commented to a, I think, uh, I don't know if it was a video where Alexia presented the raffle winner or the uh, Kenny Loggins. I don't really know. Uh, I have to check, but I did see. Uh, and thank you so much because I was going to do this like audio only. I didn't put it in my spreadsheet that this was going to be a video reaction. So I'm so happy that I saw it. Um, that's it's so important communication. Sometimes when I receive these requests, it's just like I put it down and I didn't like I missed some details. So thank you so much. I would have done it again eventually, of course, but I'm so happy. I have it pulled up. So it looks like these are um, a Japanese band of, uh, of girls. So this is called uh, Love Bites Electric Pentagram. So this is 2020. So guys, just like, this is so cool because I mean, we have basically a, a band, uh, a female band in 2020 that's doing metal. So that's really awesome. I love it. And um I can't wait to see him. So let's just move me. Let, let me let me move this here, so we can I can see the capture. And let's go. Thank you so much for the request. Can't wait to see this. All right, here we go. <laughs> yes. Holy crap. Drill guitars blazing. Yeah. Oh my god, she's influenced by Steve Harris, of course.
I mean, <laughs> what can I say? This is amazing. This is all I loved um, back in the day when I was listening to Iron Maiden, Judas Priest, the guitar, the dual guitar solos, the ego ramp, you know, like back to back playing. Um, just the whole like structure they have is so metal. I love it. It's so good. Um, and I love that people are actually there to support them. Like, but I mean, in this like amazing way and they're all beautiful, of course. Um, what a, pr I mean, j I mean, what a stage presence, you know? I mean, of course, looks are not everything. I mean, even though they weren't this beautiful, it would still be mastery. Uh, um, but I mean, just, it's like an ad, like, uh, like a huge bonus to to watch you know i mean these girls are like just ripping apart these instruments and the bass player like literally has a lot of steve harris influence i can see it the way she just like moves and she shoots you know the bass notes and the singer is fantastic the guitar players wow Th that harmony solo was re the the tapping the up like the tapping like this the upside down tapping the arpeggio section at the end sounded very um, Halloween, Halloweenish, um, really cool. And the drummer, of course, let's give her also credit to keeping everything together. She's the timekeeper. Wonderful, um, our great. What a great idea! Thank you so much. I'm definitely gonna show this to Alexa. She's gonna freak out. Um, it's so nice. It's so beautiful to see girls, uh, you know, doing this, like, there should be more girl bands, there is a really cool band, band, guys, if you want to check them out, they're called the Iron Maidens, they basically are a cover band of Iron Maiden, and, uh, you know, with permission from the band, from the original band, uh, to cover and tour, and they play literally the, the same as Iron Maiden, if not, I mean, he literally tried to, like, replicate the, the disc, you see, so um, check them out. They're really amazing, also very beautiful. And uh, wow, what can I say? I can only say like I'm blown away by these girls. Kudos really to their parents and to them for, you know, practicing and, and, and doing all this. It's, it takes a lot to play like this. So okay, let's continue. Wow, that is amazing. Thank you so much, Argray. What a great experience. And I love also that they're in costume. You know, they're like literally taking this so seriously. I mean, wonderful. Um, if I could catch them on tour, I would definitely have a lot of fun. And Alexia too. Um, this is amazing <laughs> that people do this. Like, um, you know, that uh, there's, so, like I said, it's so sad because there's like, like all girl bands, there's not that many. It's like almost like they in the 80s or in the 90s when this was happening, like this kind of music, they were, I don't know, the scourge or it wasn't like it was only for guys. Um, I don't know, man. So uh, but uh, I mean, obviously, girls are way more talented. I mean, I was blown away when Alexia first like grabbed the bass for the first time and she was always like, doo -doo 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 -doo. and I'm like, wow you're already playing like the first time i grabbed the guitar I was like i couldn't even hit the string you know i so yeah you have to be honest um so it's super cool to see 
how much talent is out there. And um, I'm super happy that you showed this to me, Argre. Thank you. I'll definitely pass it along to Alexia. She'll be blown away as well. And uh, everybody who hadn't seen them, although I did see when I pulled the video up, I saw some. There's a lot of people reacting to this, so that's cool. I love that they're getting the love they deserve and the recognition. So, but if this is your first time watching the video or us or me by myself, well, you can give me a like or subscribe, whatever you want. And uh, let me know what you think. Thank you so much and take care.